Hi everyone, what a term it has been, and can we say how wonderful it is to welcome AB families back to campus after a very challenging year last year. I'm Alistair. Hi, I'm Nina. And my name's Liam. And I'm Sarah. And we're your Dennis House leaders for 2021. We have crammed so much into this term, so let's have a look. We welcomed hundreds of new students and parents into our AB family. For our preps, day one of their school journey was a very exciting time. They were quick to join in many fun activities, including Banjo's Games, Banjo Patterson's birthday was also celebrated with our traditional poetry festival. Speaking of traditional, Year 4 kicked off the term learning about the first Australians with a trip to the Jalurgal Aboriginal Cultural Centre and enjoyed a very tasty barbecue of croc, emu and roux. Still with Year 4, there were bangs, crashes and screeches as they tried out new musical instruments. But a much more rehearsed sound came from the LPAC when our Year 5 to 8 performers finally got their chance to shine. A whole year after rehearsal started for the musical, Once Upon a Mattress. We think we understand, we think we think we know. The production was amazing. Well done everyone. Over to you, Syrah. Thanks, Liam. Our Year 6 Planeteers have been hard at work promoting new recycling initiatives through the Sustainability Club, while younger students have also been learning about caring for the environment with lunchtime guardian club sessions and a visit by Little Green Thumbs for Year 2. We had even more visitors to our college with the Star Lab Incursion for Year 5, Brainstorm Productions and Science on a Go, just to name a few. We got involved in World Read Aloud Day. It was stinky and grim. Then he pointed at Trevor and said, it was him! Clean Up Australia Day and lunchtime trivia with the Interact Club. After exercising our brains, it was time to get active. And boy, did we ever. spirit and house rivalries were on full display as we ran and as we swam during the year's 4 to 6 swimming carnival. Riot House were crowned champions at both events. But don't worry Dennis House, we'll get them next year. Right Alistair? Yeah, we really need to do something about the dominance of Riot House this year. They again took out the crown at both the Senior Cross Country Carnival and the Senior Swimming Carnival. The carnival ended with a big splash from my year 12 cohort. The class of 2021 is determined to make a big splash in all we do this year. At February's senior induction, we pledged to demonstrate strong leadership and serve as good role models for our young peers. That the class of 2021 are looking forward and that potential challenges will not deter or diminish us from achieving our goals as individuals and as leaders. We promoted the importance of physical education in schools during HPE week while our senior rugby teams gave it everything they had in preparation for games at home and away against Nambour St John's College. Take it away Nina. Thanks Alistair. The sporting achievements continued with our top swimmers doing our college proud at APS, regional and state championships. Top scholars and hard workers were awarded during Academic and Work Habits Awards assemblies for both junior and senior school. We hit the headlines with the arrival of our stunning front entrance statue, the man from Snowy River, donated by the Raptors family. And it not only connects to our values as a community, but will serve as a sign of great inspiration for all and resilience against the odds. And we went viral with over 5 million views on Channel 7 Facebook of our grounds team rescuing plover chicks. Mondays are always a highlight, with Mingling Mondays bringing together our seniors and juniors with a real party atmosphere during lunch and playtime. But perhaps the biggest party of all was the Year 12's formal at Surfers Paradise Marriott Resort, when my cohort danced the night away and celebrated the start of our final year at school. It was certainly a night to remember. 
On behalf of our mates in Lawson House and Dennis House, we'd like to say a huge thanks to everyone, staff, students and parents, who supported the recent Dennis and Lawson House movie night. Together we raised over $3,700 for charities Orange Sky Laundry, The Salvation Army and Young Care. That's a great effort. We all deserve a rest, so have a safe and happy holiday everyone. We will see you back soon for another huge term. Bye! Bye.